Hey lovelies, it is May and welcome to Night Signal. It's going to be a creepy short little indie horror um, where basically we have a new TV and some creepy stuff is coming in on the channel. So I'm not really sure what to expect aside from that. So I am just as fresh as you guys. But I want to take a quick second to thank Nicholas for giving me a key to this so I could experience it with you guys. So let's, you know, jump in, slip through some channels and see what we got going on. Whatever we plant in our subconscious mind and nourish with repetition and emotion will one day become a reality. Earl Nightingale. Is that my house? Well, I think we're here in my super dark living room. I really should open up these curtains and let some more light in. Change mm -hmm. right. channels. Static. More static. Okay. Unfortunately, right now, we have a whole lot of nothing. And now back to Ball and Chain. Okay. Robbie, where'd you put my car keys? I put them in the kitchen, my darling. Roby, did you clean the kitchen? I did, my darling. Robbie, my keys are in the garbage disposal. Oops. Sorry, my darling. <laughs> Oops. What else we got? You're about to enter a space between all known reality. A place where nothing is what it should be. A place where science is always lost and faith always misplaced. You are entering the fog space. Ooh, the fog space. In this episode, we'll be following the footsteps of a Miss Bethany Bellows. Bethany is an ordinary woman taking an evening stroll. But unknown to her, she's just taken her first steps into the fog space. Oh my! It's become so foggy all of a sudden. How peculiar. Perhaps I should head back home before it gets any foggier. Wait a minute. That's not my home! This isn't my street! Where am I? Yeah, somewhere where I, I assume don't you don't want to be. Get away! Get away! Uh, so it might be that guy. It might be me. Can I? Oh, I can read this. Okay. With your install package, you should receive the a dial, yeah, antenna, uh huh, television. Gosh, yep. Sure it's your remote dial will allow you to switch to stations. Yes. I want to change yes. the channel. If you're Only there was some kind of remote dial I could use to change the channel from anywhere, anytime. Okay, sir. You're in luck. Is that my TV? It is. The Hineker? Nice. Okay. Your picture is fuzzy. Our Try um, adjusting them. Do not operate correctly at night. Please refrain from using it after sundown. I shall not refrain. America's favorite trivia show. I'm your host, Humphrey Winters. What's that sound? That's Ooh, the sound it's of the wisdom. News. Wisdom you can only get here. Your Alright, so we have as Yeah, I mean It really does seem like What goes on at night Like a whole lot of Nothing on the TV that we actually want to watch What's that sound? That's the sound of wisdom Wisdom you can only get here You're what What's that sound? It does mean I need to it seems like my antennas only really work. They're like full on bunny Welcome ears. Back to Brain Tease, America's favorite trivia show. I'm your host, Humphrey. The, the very quick cut, okay. We just watch our ad. Is that me? Ooh. This concludes our broadcast day. Uh. 
Hello. Aha, my 1963 edition of my TV guide. Nothing. Got it. And like, <laughs> you can see the times, but they're like, yeah, we don't, we actually, we actually just don't ever watch the signal. Why are they all blank? Okay. All right, I see. So let's start with this one. Even though we're not supposed to watch it at night. Whoop. Did something. Why is it all foggy and- oh shit. <laughs> Did we enter the fog zone? Wait, which one? One of them worked there for a second. Is it two bunny ears? I see. Alright, stand back and watch it. Okay, so let's just say that one's bunny. Or like, yeah. But now we'll do like. Welcome, fellow watcher. Your eye has been opened. Rejoice. The more you watch, the better you'll see. Seek more signals tonight and let the guide teach you its blessing. Okay, well, let's try. And now back to Only Father Knows. Son, let me tell you what it means to truly be a man. I think this is the right signal. Wait, what is Welcome this, back. Wilson? Okay. Welcome back, folks. I'm Benson Brown, and this is Channel 1 News. Okay. Um, I want to watch more Fox Space. Don't touch that dial. Don't adjust your television. And don't look behind you. You've stepped into the fog space. Nah, no, I already looked behind me. It's just me. In this episode, we trace the steps of a Mr. Patrick Pinkerton. A and anyone else used to watch, like, The Twilight Zone a lot, like, young, when it probably wasn't the best, the get a little too creeped out. Unlucky for him, this particular Is that the dog in? Hello? Doggy? From fog space. I can't come to the funeral, honey. The TV guide said it was too dangerous. I can't. Oh, Patrick, can't you see that this guide is ruining your life? It's just a TV guide. Ah, uh, nah. Understand. It's more than a guide. It's a lifestyle wife. Alright, um... No? Okay. Welcome back, folks. I guess we are going to go ahead and, like... Back, folks. Let's and watch back to Only Father, Father Knows. knows. Son, let me tell you what it means to truly be a man. Okay. I don't want to hear about how the guy's going to ruin my life. Means never I'm going to be surprised. Emotion, with the exception of Silly TV. Rage. Okay. Being a man, son, means you got to put on real big shoes. Not clown shoes, though. Not like clown shoes. Clowns aren't real men. Okay, Dad. Wow, okay. Son, listen to me. Super listen rude to, to clowns. Me, when you're a man, the President of the United States will come to your house and shake your hand to congratulate you on your manhood. That's how <laughs> you'll know you made it. I... Okay. Beg to differ. Son, I must confess something to you. The President has never shaken my hand. I'm a fraud, son. Okay. Oh, no, and now, Dad. a word from our sponsor. Gosh, it sure is tiring having to stand up and turn the dial anytime I want to change the channel. If only there was some kind of remote dial I could use. But to I already the have it. Let's not watch that. Art space it is. Don't touch that dial. Don't adjust your television. And don't look behind you. You've stepped into the fog space. In this episode, we trace the steps of a Mr. Patrick Pinkerton. A formerly faithless man who recently found a newfound faith in an unlikely place, tucked away in the pages of his television guide. Unlucky for him, this particular guide was packaged, postage, and shipped from the fog space. I can't come to the funeral, honey. The TV guide said it was too dangerous. I can't. Oh, Patrick, can't you see that this guide is ruining your life? It's just a TV guide! 
You don't understand. It can see into the future, honey. I've shown you. Every show comes on at exactly the time it says. It's a TV guide, Patrick! <laughs> She's they like, literally, that's how it's there. supposed to be. Who could that be at the door? Alright, doesn't it? Ooh, the light went out, though. Can I see outside yet? Concludes our broadcast day. No. Looks like everything's slowly going low. Weird music. All right, let's try a different signal. Oh, the fog's creeping back down. Oh shit! I'm melting. Oh no! Quick, change it. Interesting. Alright, so question is, do we do we let it melt us? I'm not sure. Definitely interesting. Okay. Hmm. Gonna just throw back up into my normal self. See what else we got on. Oh, that's. Oh, oh, hello. Uh. Okay, Mr. Hands, how do I. A new TV guy up here? Okay. English entertainment guaranteed to make you wiggle. The feelers sent an invitation for you to take part in the shenanigan. Feel the tingle and a tickle. It may be a fantabulous finger for feeler at your feet. How do I. Oh. Goo Goo helps you remember the small time. You are nothing. You are but pathetic flesh mass. You are small. You are melt. Desirable out of reach. Melting. You are slime. Goo Goo brings you back. The simpler times. Okay, but how do I stop the feelers? Do I need to, like, just full on? Resume. Okay. okay. Let's try changing the TV. I got tickled. Okay. Do I just have to avoid these for the rest of the night? That's not necessarily going to be the easiest task. Okay. We've got, we've got another signal to watch. But these ticklers are all over our house. Oh. Uh, beeble wargle fru. Neeps po wobble beeble go boob. Nippy wo diggles. Pen and and chug. Heal the bone. Oh. Waggle waggle waggle. Do not the fog stay beeble or. Nipper the glipper watch noopers. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. I'm definitely. Oh, the blabber. Unrelatable conversation to have come out of a mouth. Listen with sincerity. Talking about anything just as a close personal companion would be. I would love to talk to Blobber, I think. Right. So far, I think those all stay the same. It's just like ramblings of a madman. What's my new guide? It's normal to be scared, Watcher. They promise not to punish, but to teach. Study them. See them. You are well on your way. Okay. Hello? I can't quite make out what I'm trying to be told. Alright. What are you looking at? Here? There? Nowhere in particular? Or all of the above is the likely answer. I feel like For these are almost different days slash nights, space. and maybe we're just not being told. Today's episode, we will learn what it means to wield a power beyond belief. Meet Hank Humdinger, the CEO of a major American technology company. Hank has been hiding a secret, one he is prepared to take to his grave. But unknown to him, 
it's this very secret that will lead him to the fog space. Dun dun dun, the fog space. Well, his secret sure is hard to keep, but that's why I'm such a great CEO. Now, back to business. No! No, I'm not ready! We had a deal! <laughs> we had a deal! My neighbors really need to calm their doggy down, huh? And now, a word from our sponsor. Gosh, I need to get to work on time, but my food is cold. I need oh. to eat in the next 30 seconds or else my boss will have my head. Lucky for you, there's the zippy microwave. Micro what? Ooh, I, I would like a zippy microwave. I'm going to be late for work and I'm also hungry. The zippy microwave can heat up anything in just 30 seconds. Watch. Are we making popcorn? Or are you... I think you're supposed to stare at a microwave while it cooks. La 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 la. <laughs> Let's just uh, water our plants. Can we turn on our lamp? No? Okay. Wow, that was quick. I gotta get me one. Never miss a moment with the Zippy Microwave. And now, back to our scheduled program. What are you looking at? Here? There? Oh, no, we already watched that one. Let's now, watch. Our local weather report with oh, weather. Thank you, Benson. As you know, we've been having quite the tizzy of non-stop fog this past week. Non-stop fog. Okay, so... Am I not in the fog zone? Am I just, like, watching too much TV and it's making me hallucinate? Rot my brain because of these weird messages? This concludes our broadcast day. Okay. Ooh, what is that? Kazuzu, what's that ear piercing sound? It must be Kazuzu time. This form gives away to the best audible experience. Soundscapes for your unborn offspring to dance the night away. Interesting. Right. Let's go finagle these and see what else we can get up to tonight. Oh shoot, no, not more feelies. No, no, not more ticklies. Ah. What is that? The shouting one. Silent shouts makes the day slide. Feel strong, raw anxiety inside. Let it out. Let it ride. You become what you are afraid. Scream as loud as you can, but noise do not. It's almost time, but not yet. Shout now or shout never. <laughs> the Beezel. Laughing antics and chortle experiences provide for the whole family unit. Join Beezle every night and share in the belly fun. If you can't make time for Beezle, Beezle will surely make time for you. Right. Oh, no, it's got me. No. Oh, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. I died. No. again. <laughs> Not that channel. What is that one? Flathead makes your top drop. Tops need not be top with flathead. Enjoy the crumble of tops as they descend. You can be a flathead too. Crumble, crumble, crumble. Stop melting me please so I can change my channel. Oh god. Imagine you're like... Imagine you're just like melting your butt off with the tickles. Oh shit. Well, we might die. No, Muzum. Uh, oh shit, my house was crumbling. Oh god, there's ticklers everywhere. Um, 
I'm not so certain how to stop them. That's just crumbling, that's melting. Oof. Okay. I don't know how to make the ticklers go away is the problem. I'm like, oh. Can I like shoot stuff? I can, no wonder. How often can I do that? All right, now that I've figured out we're like magic, our, our new TV remote. Oh, that one jumped. Oh, it didn't jump. I'm just getting tiny. Okay. Nice. Messed up. Your eyes are adjusting. You see as you are meant to see. Do not lose faith, Watcher. Okay. Not losing faith. I like how their end of broadcast comes in just fine. I don't know what that is. The bug of one and only. Humdrum wants to make the bad in your body good again. Let your fleshy fruit blossom bloom with the hum. Space your thoughts and have no quarrel with Humdrum. I think Humdrum heals us. Okay. So, let me double check which one the feelers are. I'm avoiding that crap. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, wow. What is that? Make time for thought with sweet. Thought of the unknowable. Make unheard wishes to those inside the fog. Your wish come true? Sweet knows it won't, but sweets can't be stopped. Sweets must wish. Keep wishing, keep wishing. Oh. Oh. Disorienting. <laughs> Would anybody like to come help? My TV is doing crazy things tonight. Alright. Let's see. I think as long as we avoid channel 4. Then we won't have the feeler. Right? So let's just put it on one, go to three, and not go to the tickle one. Let's check like one, two, three. The signal's not on tonight. Let's, let's stay here. Is that our lamp? I refuse. I refuse to do the tickles. Did I already check, like, open bunny ears? Whoever okay. is out there making all the light, they're up again. Not particularly new. 
now. Ooh. Survived another night. The days become shorter as the nights grow longer. The glorious fog is coming to take the faithful. Seek more signals, grow your knowledge. The everlasting night is nearly upon us. Okay. Let's see. Where's our reg regular signals at? Close enough. We'll just not really listen to the news because it's broken. But... The neighbors sound like they're at it again. And stay inside, I shall. Anyone can make out like most of what's being shouted on my neighbor's house. Like, leave a comment down below. I'm interested. Mouth full of bread, flutter and swim so swell, swollen so wet, gristle and crunch with a tune of quack. Whole family is entertained by quack antics. Oh shit, what the hell? Wasn't one of these a healy one? Heal me! Yeah, stop knocking. I can't. I can't right now. There's a there's a bunch of flyers in here. Shoot! Shoot more! <laughs> Run around in circles. What is that ball? What the hell is going on in my house? Do I touch you? Oh shit, there's something at the door now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I can't kill that. Oh no. Uh. We are just letting all the, the goofy goopers in the apartment, aren't we? Okay, I'm not sure that, like, that's actually resetting my, my remote. But it makes me feel better. After I deal with these flying hand fingies, we'll go ahead and like read some of the stuff and then go through some of the other channels. Okay, I think we only have. Okay. The night orb. Tell it like it is. What's the motivation of the sacred orb? Witness the light of forbidden knowledge. Feel the vibration of your skull. Know its truths and your sensations. Keep the secrets deep in your brain hole. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Let's try the finger one again. So oh, it's the left ear. Oh, that's a one hit? Oh shit, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Concludes the nightly broadcast. Alright, we visited Beagle for the day. Ooh, what the hell is that? Oh, there's somebody on the couch. Oh, I'm being tickled to death. I can't see shit. I'm melting. I think it's walking now. I hear bones. Oh man. Oh, it's definitely dancing. Oh shit. It's like, hey yo. 
you really shouldn't be on this channel. I'm like, oh, I know, but dang. <laughs> Watch your back. Skelly takes more damage than others, but it can be killed. Okay, interesting. Okay, Skelly Welly. Skelly is pleasing to your bones. Fill your bones, listen to them. They desire the soil. The Skelly Welly aims to please. Skelly gives the gift of soil to the watchers that wish. Okay. I cannot see shit. Like, I'm pretty sure he can't touch us or whatever. Yes? Oh, that's terrifying. Uh, so I think the knocking is Beazel. If we hear the knock, we want to go to Beazel's channel. Or he doesn't, like, kill us for no reason. Oh. Okay, so they're definitely on the open hands. What are they? Is it crackers? Oh shit. survived. Uh, okay, okay. The time is nigh. Watcher's night is upon us. Tonight the faithful will be saved. Find the remaining gaps in your knowledge. Seek the signal wisdom in its entire I need to make strange the eternal bliss of the Okay. Let me see what I'm missing first. Okay, so. Before we start... We have got my trusty notepad out. Let's see what we already have. So we have channel two, this one. We have channel two of the other one. People gets pissed at us a lot. We have channel four of that one. We have channel three. We have channel three, channel three. Okay, so basically all the channel threes it looks like almost. 
Well, that's nice. Um, the channel one. So we're done on the up ears. Okay. Channel two. Channel four. Okay, so we only need, we need two channel ones on our right and an open, channel two on open. Okay, so hopefully we can get these easy. We only need four channels. Let's start with an open. Oh, Watcher Night is upon us. Gaze give sight. Okay, gaze give sights to the watching. Um, let gaze see inside. Gaze gives the eyes the strength to fulfill. Be fulfilled and seek the new truth. Feel proximity to fog and rejoice. Okay, so I need to quickly just murder the feelers. All of them. What is freaking out? Can't. Oh, if gaze is a problem. I'm thinking not. The feelers definitely are. I think Quacker is. Find all the signals or the night shall never end. Oh, fuck. Okay. Did I get to keep the true gaze though? No. Okay. so bad. And then we can go this one. Oh shit, Skelly's on this one apparently. What the hell? What is that? Hubs knows what's best. He is the one with the hubs. The ground on which you stand is slow. We gooey and hubs are to that. You cannot live up to hub standards. Okay, so I think we're just slowed down. Which, honestly, I'm fine with that. I can live, I can live with that. Okay, so we just need open one and two. And to not turn our back to Skelly ever. Why is my TV huge? <laughs> the wide open eyes can see, can you, can you hear it? Which is tasting good. The final signal has now appeared. Ooh, okay. Do I just... 
funny ear to it then? Is this the final signal? I can't change the channel anymore. It got really big, but I can't change anything. I'm just gonna, gonna chill, I guess. Oh wait, do I need to like enter the door? I'm very confused. I mean, I can try. It's just, I might get chased around by Skelly if I'm wrong about this. Oh, I did it. I hear Skelly though, he's right behind me. the creator of Night Signal. If you are reading this, it means you played the whole game through to the end and I appreciate your time and eyeballs. This is a peek into the game's art and process. Regardless of what you thought of it, Night Signal is the result of a whole lot of love and messy labor. Enjoy this look into the loving mess. I'm gonna probably read through those on my own time, but I wanted to go ahead and like scroll through it really quick so you guys could pause and read it if you don't intend to play for yourself. You can still like look into some of the process of how this game came to light, but if you are interested in playing in it, play, playing it? <laughs> if you're interested in playing it, I will go ahead and leave a Steam link down in the description below so you can check it out yourself and see if you can, you know, survive the hordes of signals and see what messy combinations you guys can get yourself into to avoid and run circles. Um, but yeah, overall, I thought it was definitely a unique game. It was enjoyable. I got stuck a couple times because I was bad at mechanics. <laughs> Besides that, and the somewhat confusing ending, not a bad game. Until next time, it's been Ismay. Thank you so much for hanging out, and I will see you all soon for more.